Hey guys, this is Martin again and welcome back to our web mini-series around most useful tools for penetration testers and bug bounty hunters. So today I want to show you a repo called Payload All The Things. You may or may not heard of it, but this is like one of the holy grails for penetration testers and bug bounty hunters. Reason for that is because it has a fast amount of uh, vulnerabilities and of proof of concepts on the on the website right so for example if you think of cross-site scripting like one of the most classic vulnerabilities you come to the cross-site scripting section you, you get a good overview of what cross-site scripting is but more importantly you get like all the different variations like for example xss in html applications right like um so classic ones and classic payloads and then here you have your payloads and they are already like prepared and they are all based on previous findings effectively and i'm not saying they work out of the box for you right like but sometimes you simply need to um, make changes and accommodate it but it gives you a very good hint where it's possible like for example if you find a file upload or something like this and um you you figure out that the extension svg or svg files are being allowed so immediately alarm bells should sound and you go like hey what i want to test now i want to test for xss in SVG files, right? I want to test for um, uh, XXE in SVG files. Like, um, and then you simply come over here, right? And you can copy the payload out. And this is the payload for you with an alert document domain, right? In an SVG file. And then you save this as SVG and that's it. And the same goes like for all the other vulnerability types, right? Like, so regardless what you're looking for, if you, for example, uh, encounter or you wanna you wanna get better at open redirects and then first of all, overview of, of open redirects and then the typical bypasses, right? Like, so for example, um, the two forward slashes, the four forward slashes, um, the mixture of forward and backslash, um, like here, right? And then with nil bytes and all these kind of things. And it, no one can remember all these different payload variations. This is why this website is incredibly useful when you stumble across things like that. It also gives you like a, a, a hint of what are the most common redirect parameters like next URL, right? Like redire, redirect underscore URI, URL and stuff like that. So it's, it's extremely useful and even even if you're new to it, right? Like you don't need to understand every single payload. You, um, just try to read through it and try to understand what this specific payload is doing. So this is extremely useful and I highly encourage you to check it out. Um, it's on GitHub and I will paste the, the link in the description below. If you like this video, please like it and subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you in the next one.